Today's video is sponsored by Helix Sleep. So welcome back to the sawmill, friends. Today's video is sponsored by Helix. And let's go ahead and talk about them real fast and we'll get on today's video, which is sawing up some cedar and loading up the kiln. Now I got my first Helix Sleep mattress about maybe two, almost three months ago, actually. And I will say this about it. They are sponsoring this video and they are paying me to do this ad, but I will tell you about it anyways, guys, because it works that good. I'm really happy with it. It works really well. Before I was using that mattress, I had a lot of pain in my hip. And I know a lot of you guys out there that work all day doing labor intensive jobs like I do running the sawmill, sleep is very important. And that mattress has really made me sleep better, guys. It's took my hip pain away. I'm not sure why my hip was even bothering me in the first place, but that mattress has miraculously taking all that pain away. Helix Sleep makes premium mattress and bedding that are customized to fit your needs and conveniently shipped right to your door. Everybody's different and Helix knows that. That's why they made the sleep quiz to match your unique body type and sleep preferences to make the perfect mattress for you. They have something for everyone's unique taste. And if you sleep with a partner, you can even take the sleep quiz together and find something that's the perfect compromise for both of you. I found it relatively easy to go on their website and take the quiz. Based on my results, Helix matched me up with the Lutz Sunset Mattress. Now me personally, I like a medium firm mattress and I also have lower back pain. So that mattress was chosen to me due to my personal characteristics and needs. Now the days of taking a pickup truck and hauling a mattress home are over friends. This actual mattress came in a vacuum sealed package and with the help of one person, I was able to easily transport it upstairs to the master bedroom. I then unwrapped the mattress and also inflated it by removing all the packaging material. With your Helix Sleep Mattress, you get a 100 night sleep trial along with a 10 year warranty and there are financing options and flexible payment plans. Helix also delivers your mattress right to your door for free within the US. I love my Helix and I think you would too. If you're looking for a new bed, check out Helix. Click on the link below or go to helix.com slash the woods. Right now you could save up to $200 off your Helix sleep mattress plus two free pillows. So once again, a real big thank you to Helix for sponsoring today's video and don't forget free shipping right now in the US, you can't beat that. And guys, I would really appreciate it if you would support my sponsors. Those are the people that help keep me up here at the sawmill making videos for you guys. All right, friends, we'll talk about this log while it's on the ground so I can turn the sawmill on and get the saw. And when we load it on the Doyle scale, it's about, what are we looking at here? About 10 inch diameter. So it's calling for 23 board feet total because this is a 10 foot log. If you like this little ruler here, friends, I got mine from Log Route. There's a link down below. Go check it out. If you do a lot of sawing, I highly recommend one of these. It'll save you a lot of time and figuring up board footage on logs. This is Eastern Red Cedar. A lot of people call it Juniper. We all know what it is. You guys can argue down in the comments below what you think it is, but around here, we call it Red Cedar. We're sawing this into four quarter boards on random width, probably shooting for about seven inches, maybe wider. We'll see how this goes. Let's get it loaded up and get going.
All right, friends, let me address something here real fast. I get this question in a lot of my videos here lately. People are asking me, why I don't use this tool anymore to square up the cans? Well, here's the deal. If I'm doing four quarter boards, I don't really care if it's off just a little because once it air dries, kiln dries, and goes through a molder, it's not gonna matter. Now, if I'm cutting dimensional stuff like two by sixes or four by fours, I'm gonna take the time to use this tool to make sure it's nice and square. That's why you don't see me using this as often because here lately we've been cutting a lot of four by fours, not four by fours. We've been cutting a lot of four quarter stock, one inch boards, therefore it doesn't matter if they're square on the sides as much. Now I do watch these bat stops right here. I do want the cant to be flat against them. I want the stuff as square as I can get it, but it's not really worth the time to walk over here and check it with this when it's not gonna matter anyways. Now, like I was saying, if I'm doing four by fours or eight by eights, Grab this tool, make sure you're squared up, all right? All right, that covers that. And uh, one more thing here. On the sawmill, Joe Main Silver Tip Turbo 7. If you want those blades, friends, give Joe a phone call. His cell phone number is down in the video description. And one more thing here, friends, we'll get going. I'm going to the Paul Bunyan show again this year. I think it's October the 7th. I think that's the right date, the weekend of the 7th. If it's not the right date, then there's a link down below to their website. You can go check out all the specifics and the location of the event. I'll be at the Woodmiser tent on Friday and the Logwright tent on Saturday. And here in the next few weeks, I'll let you guys know what times I'm gonna be there. I'm not gonna be there for the full day because last year I was, and there was a lot of downtime between people coming around. I kind of got bored, to be honest with you, just sitting there all day. So we'll do a few hour blots in the morning and a few hours in the afternoon. So Paul Bunyan Show, come out and see us. Uh, Mike Morden's going to be there as well. Uh, Buck and Billy Ray, uh, freaking Jeep, Mark DeLacy, uh, Killinger. There's a lot of people going to be here besides me. Should be a good time. Oh. And I'm bringing my dad with me, so you might get to meet my dad also, but he may be walking around. He probably won't sit around with me all day, but you might see him walking around some of the exhibits looking at stuff. So uh, there you go. Paul Bunyan, see you there.